Hey, what is up? Operation iDroid here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to watch the latest movies and TV shows on your iOS device without a jailbreak or a computer. Now, the application we're going to be using to do this is the amazing streaming service Popcorn Time that offers a massive catalog of movies and TV shows that you can stream on your iOS device with a gorgeous 1080p and subtitles in many different languages if you'd also like that. This application is awesome, and I hope you all are excited to learn how to do this. If so, then please hit that like button as it helps out the video tremendously, and I truly appreciate it. But now, without any further ado, let's head into the tutorial. Alright, getting popcorn time is very simple, and all you have to do is open Safari and type in the URL bit.ly forward slash popcorn time iOS with the PT and OS in iOS capitalized. The capitalization is super important in order for you to be sent to the right website. I also have a link to this website in the description below if you just want to copy and paste it. Anyways, upon arriving at the website, click on the green download button at the bottom and an install prompt will appear. Go ahead and hit install and popcorn time will begin to install. If popcorn time does not install for you and gives you an error message that says popcorn time cannot be installed at this time then unfortunately Apple has shut it down, but you can check the website again in a couple of days and it'll probably be working then. Once you have Popcorn Time installed, it'll say that it's an untrusted enterprise developer and you'll have to trust it. In order to do that, go to your settings, go to general, scroll down to profiles and device management or just device management and find the enterprise app certificate for Popcorn Time and hit trust. Once you've hit trust, you'll be able to open Popcorn Time and enjoy the application. Now, if at any time in the future Popcorn Time does not open for you and says to trust it again, then it has also been shut down by Apple and all you have to do is go back to the website and reinstall it. Anyways, once you get Popcorn Time, it'll ask you to accept its terms and conditions and as you can see it has movies, shows, and anime. At the time I'm recording this video, anime is not working, but hopefully in the future it will be working, so give it a shot if you want to watch an anime. Anyways, when you are searching for movies or TV show, you can funnel by clicking the little funnel next to the search icon at the top, and you can decide whether you want to watch a popular movie, a top rated movie, or whatever the case may be. There's also genres if you just want to see movies for specific genres. As well as there's also the search tab as you can see at the top right if you want to search for a specific movie. Anyways, heading to the settings of Popcorn Time, you'll see that you can set a preferred quality which is super cool because Popcorn Time is one of the only iOS movie streaming services that allows you to use 1080p and it looks beautiful on iPhones. They also have subtitle settings that you can mess around with if you are going to use subtitles. And finally, if you want to watch a movie or TV show, it's very simple. All you have to do is click on it and then um, click play. That's pretty much it. If you want to add subtitles, you can also add subtitles. And then basically, it'll stream the movie for you on your iOS device. Now, the process of streaming it and getting all the torrents ready really depends on your internet connection, whether you're using Wi-Fi or cellular. So that's up to you. But once it's done, your movie or TV show will begin to play and you'll be able to enjoy it on your iOS device with some stunning 1080p quality. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please leave a like as it helps out the video tremendously and it's greatly appreciated as well as Comment down below what your thoughts on Popcorn Time are. What do you think of this application? I would love to hear what you all have to say as I read all the comments. Finally, if you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe by clicking on my icon and hitting subscribe to be notified whenever I upload another video like this one. As well as if you want to check out some more of my videos, you can click on them on screen now. And as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing and welcome to the operation.